Hey, what's up everybody? It's the beer guys here. We're doing something a little different today. Instead of just our usual beer pairing, we're actually gonna do beer cooking with our friends from Icicle Brewing. You see the hat up top? We are going to be doing their Oktoberfest beer brat with an apple cider kraut. Now, if you're like me, you've been missing beer fest this year, you've been missing Oktoberfest. This is a great easy way to bring Oktoberfest into your home and have it all through the winter. Super simple, if I can do it, anyone can do it. So I'm gonna be cooking it at my house. We also got Rafa and Tracy cooking it over at their house. We're gonna see who comes up with the best. Stay tuned and also check our next video to see our conversation with Pam from Icicle Brewing. So to make the Oktoberfest beer brats and apple cider kraut, you will need brats, sauerkraut, buns, onions, apple cider, and Icicle's Dirty Face Amber. And for an extra treat, you can get the Munchen House Dirty Face Amber Mustard made at Icicle with the Dirty Face Amber. First, we're gonna start by sauteing some onions. Now, the green stuff is tarragon. Tarragon and sauteed onions is an amazing little treat. Some friends of mine, and I, we actually discovered it. Uh, our wives were gone and we were barbecuing and throwing random stuff in a mixed, mixed food. None of us knew what tarragon was or what it did, so we threw tarragon in with some onions and sauteed them. Turns out it was amazing. So ever since then, I've been trying to throw some tarragon and my sauteed onions, any chance I can get. And after that, a few minutes on the grill. I'm gonna yeah, get close on how to make a bratwurst. I'm the grill champion. <laughs> should I make four? I should make five. Good. He's Ooh, nice. Okay. Don't cut yourself. <laughs> Let's say the dice. What, how do you want this, Tracy? You want it long or short? I was uh, too long, because it's going to be in uh, on top, I'm guessing. Uh, no, nah, short. You like them short? Yeah, I don't like the onion, uh, not because you gotta bite into it real hard. And if not, it's like cheese pizza. I love it. <laughs> it's my favorite. And the onion slap in the face, <laughs> and it's all hot. <laughs> Split my bra Yeah, I usually, I usually do I too. Oh, uh -oh what happened? There's a uh, good thing I was standing over here. Oh my goodness. This thing just started to rise and like. Now for the brats themselves, you wanna take a pan, and coat it with some oil, not a whole lot, and get it warm, but not quite to where the oil burns. As we get the pan ready, we're going to sear the brats on each side before dunking them in the beer. Now ideally, you wanna be able to create some space. However, with the pan I got, just drop it in. With the pan I got, there's not a whole lot of space for these, for these bad boys. I'll flip it so I can get a steady For the second method, first we brought the dirty face amber to a simmer, then put the brats in the simmering beer. Uno, dos, uh, three, and numero four. So as you can see, we got this nice brown tinge around the brats. There you go. So now it's about time to add the beer. What we're gonna do is we're gonna add, it says two cups, but if you know math, eight ounces is a cup, two cups is 16 ounces, which is a pint. So we're gonna add this fine, dirty face amber lager. Just enough to cover the brats. And then we're gonna turn it low to simmer and rotate frequently so that the whole brat gets covered by this wonderful, wonderful beer. Okay, next we're going to make the apple cider kraut. So like I said, we've got some sauerkraut that's been sitting in some apple cider, you know, the good stuff with the chunks on the bottom. We're gonna put it on a pan that's on slight medium heat and we're gonna just dump it in. Make sure to drain the sauerkraut of any excess liquid before you cook it in the pot with the apple cider. Add enough cider to cover the sauerkraut. I think you just need to cover it. Now we're gonna stir it up to make sure 
that the kraut gets sat in the apple cider. But, and then we are going to turn it and let it simmer, covered, until the kraut gets nice and golden. We'll come back to that. Boil the brats till they are nice and firm. And then if you want to, brown your buns in some butter for extra texture and flavor. When you're cooking, man, it helps to have a, I don't know, preparation drink. I have the Alpen Haze by Icicle. It's their hazy IPA. This thing is 12 fluid ounces, 6.3%. Oh my goodness. Look at that perfect color. This thing is juice in a can. Oh, so good. So we just sauteed onions and butter. Last but not least, it's time to finish up our brats. Since we use the second method instead of the first that Paul used, our brats are already cooked. So now we just need to brown them on the outside for a minute or two and everything will be ready to assemble. Hey everyone, welcome to the Beer Guys special edition featuring Pamela from Icicle Brewery from Leavenworth, Washington. And we're gonna do pair pairing with Brats, uh, the special Munchausen uh, restaurant. We gotta do that over. I'm doing too much on, um, do it over. <laughs> <laughs> 